A lot of the fans were looking for the over the back call and still heavily defended. On over to the baseline, Pippinger gets the bucket to go and he'll go to the free throw line for one. It's over instead of taking the screen by Nehoff, now he comes back to get it. He didn't sign a Nehoff, the dribble goes up, gets the basket and he'll go to the line for one. That's a big time play there by Nate. You go back over to the right side, Furlow with the basketball, pulls up the three, this one off the back of the rim, no good, but tipped back in by Pippinger. And another missed shot here by Rich, who seems to have just completely lost everything that he has done in this game so far. Aaron Thomas underneath for the Red Wolves, and it's a four-point ball game. Furlow, under two minutes to go in the second half. Furlow, this one is good! And that's one thing, you got to give Jordan Furlow the ball and let him take over. He is hot right now, keep feeding him the ball. One of those heart-stopping moments if you're an IU East fan. Furlow down in the right corner, he goes baseline, Shang all over him, kicks out the Pippinger. Now Rollins, he'll go down low and gets this one to go, and one! Because even if you do, Davenport's going to get the ball back and you will still have one more possession of the ball game. Rollins down to the inside, one-handed, no good, and it's going to be Pippinger that gets to the ball. Go ahead, basket for the Red Wolves, 82 to 80. Now to 12 in the shot clock for IU East. Merlot crosses over, down to seven, steps back, takes this one, and it's good for two. But hey, two ties the ball game. Um, that step back was beautiful. Uh, that's, I don't know what else to say other than that. Passes broken up that time. Pippinger gets the steal for the Red Bulls. Nice pass, finds Furlow, lays this one in, and it's now 90 to 88 in favor of the Red Wolves. Furlow goes over to the left side. Kick out Claypool for the three. Bam. This one's good! Jacoby Claypool puts the Red Wolves up by five with 11.3 to go. Big win here tonight for the Red Wolves, 93 to 88 uh, over uh, Davenport, the third ranked team in the country. Huge, huge win for the Red Wolves.